Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In previous video, we saw what is lookup relationship, in which we understood that it's just an association between two objects and the relationship is not that tight. What do I mean by that is, if a parent is deleted, child does not get deleted in case of a lookup relationship. Now in this video, we are going to understand what is a master data relationship. So master data relationship is a bit tighter relationship as compared to that of a lookup relationship. What do I mean by that is, in case if a parent record, parent object record is deleted, child also gets deleted. We will move to our notepad to understand it properly. So right now I have created an object named as company which is a parent object and another uh, another object is employee that is a child object so basically i have created a relationship between both of them that is a master detail relationship and the name of the company the company record name is xyz and there are three employees working in this company ram sham and sundar so in case if you built a master detail relationship in that case if xyz that is a company xyz is deleted automatically ram sham sundar records will be also deleted in case of master detail relationship on the other hand, if it was a lookup relationship, even though XYZ was deleted, Ram Sham Sundar record would still exist. This is what we call master data relationship. Like if the parent is deleted, automatically child records will also get deleted. Now, I have created two objects for the same. One is company, another, another one is nothing but the employee. Now we have to build a master data relationship in between this company and employee. As company is our parent object and employee is our child object as we have previously also said we have to be, whenever we have to build a relationship we have to build a relationship by a child object so now in this case employee is our child object so in order to build a relationship between company and employee we have to create a relationship via child so I am going to create a new field we will go first to the child object and then click on fields and relationship and then click on new as we can see it is asking for multiple types we will select master detail relationship and then click on next with which object we need to create a relation as we know we have to create a relationship with company object click on next Again click on next, click on next, click on next, save it, that's it. This is how a master detail relationship as we can see it is showing with the employee has a master detail relationship with company. So this is how we built a master detail relationship in Salesforce. There are much more benefits of building a master detail relationship that the field becomes required on the page layout the the you can build a roll up summary field between these two objects and many more we will understood uh, we will understand about this uh, what are the benefits uh, in the next video in the upcoming videos or so this is all about the master detail relationship in salesforce if you like this video please subscribe to our channel